Hey guys, now I don't know how many of you are coffee drinkers or beer drinkers or drinkers of any beverage that you want to remain the same temperature over the course of when you're drinking it. But I've got something really interesting and unusual for you guys today and I think you're gonna find this pretty cool. Now, here we have a mug. It's a very special mug. It's a type of thermos, if you heard of a thermos. But this is actually a lab grade Dewar. Now if you don't know what a Dewar is, you can think of it like a really good thermos. A thermos is a container which has a layer of vacuum between the outside and inside which prevents heat from transferring. So basically it keeps the temperature of your beverage or whatever's inside the same temperature for a very long time. Now the difference between a lab grade Dewar made into a mug and a regular thermos is this is way better basically. This is something that might be used to hold liquid nitrogen at the same temperature for up to several days. And liquid nitrogen has to remain below a certain temperature or else it evaporates into gas nitrogen. Now, I had been thinking about what would happen if you turned a Dewar into a mug, and apparently someone beat me to the idea because this is actually called a Stein of Science. A guy who runs a store called Funranium Labs actually makes these. They cost about $250. But if you want to make your own, you could probably buy a Dewar for maybe $150 or so, so you can save some money if you want to make one yourself. This actually just showed up, and the test they use to make sure that the vacuum is intact is you put ice inside. So I put a bunch of ice in there, and it's pretty much all still there. I just put in a few, few minutes ago, so I'd hope it would be. And basically, you leave it overnight. Hopefully, by the next day, the ice is still in there. That's a good test to show that it's working. Now basically the reason I got this is for the cool factor. It's completely unnecessary, but I used to be a physics major. I'm now a physics minor. I have interacted with these and I thought they were really cool. So the idea of having one as a mug is just amazing to me. I don't know, maybe the other geeks and nerds out there will appreciate this, but I think this is just so cool. Now this particular one holds about 12 ounces. I think it's like 350 milliliters. They do sell bigger ones like 660 milliliters which is better if you're drinking like a big beer or something, but this is pretty much, I got this one because it's closer to a regular 12 ounce coffee mug. Now this would probably be a really good gift if you have a geek in the family. This is probably something they have not even seen before, but they might think is awesome. So I guess that's pretty much all I have to say about this. If you guys have any questions about it, you can leave me a comment. Also, don't forget to subscribe and like the video as well. That helps because I try to make new videos every week and I'll try to introduce more cool stuff like this. So I'm interested in hearing what you guys have to say. So thanks for watching and cheers.